I can get 30 miles per charge on this hog. Seriously though guys, this is called the Euro Scooter. If you come down here to the Bargain Barn, you can actually drive this thing around while you shop and they even have them for sale. I think he said this thing gets 30 miles per charge and goes 22 miles per hour. Look at that little thing. We're gonna be riding that around here today. Today we are at the Bargain Barn in Louisville, Ohio. This place is absolutely enormous. I had no idea what to expect when I was pulling up. I thought I was gonna find like a little shop or something. But when I pulled in, I saw 10 enormous barns on the property. Now, right now, you've got like this one over here. We're gonna explore in a minute. It's full of furniture. And you've got two huge barns here, 50,000 square feet full of merchandise. We're gonna go explore both of those right now. I looked around a little bit in here the other day and there is so much stuff I can't even begin to tell you and all kinds of like obscure stuff as well as, I don't know, food and, and laundry detergent and just all kinds of stuff, anything you can imagine in here. Let's hop on our trusty Harley over here <laughs> and take a ride through here, see what we can find. First, let me jump on this thing and I'm just gonna show you real quick the barns all around this area here. I was talking to the owner and he said that uh, the ultimate goal is to have every one of these barns full of merchandise. And let me tell you, they are enormous inside. Yeah, he says that eventually he wants to have every one of these full of merchandise and like themed for the specific kind of merchandise there is. This thing's fun. <laughs> okay guys, we're gonna take our hog on a ride around both of these barns. We've got a hallway here, then we got another hallway back here. And, uh, and it leads to both of these enormous barns. 50,000 square feet of stuff in here. I don't even know how long we're gonna be in here, but there's a lot of stuff. Holy crap, guys, look what I see right off the bat. Trump $100 bill wallets. <laughs> oh my God. Rock candy. These things are so good. I remember getting these when I was a kid. My sister like loved them and I was like, what are these all about? And they're so delicious. Shotgun ammo knife. Look at this, guys. It unfolds. It's a little knife in a, a shotgun shell. That's pretty cool. Look at this, guys. I'm not even kidding. They've got a little bit of everything in here. Baseball cards, gold and silver, bullion. What? I don't even know what that is. <laughs> Jewelry. Oh, my God. Look at this huge Harley ring down here. I should be wearing that while I drive the little Harley over here. Oh my god, MREs. Vegetable sausage crumbles and spicy tomato sauce. Meatballs, chili and macaroni. Look at this, 10 foot charging cables. And it's for iPhone too. I don't know if there's other different kinds. Yeah. Six bucks for these, that is an awesome price. Holy crap, look at this. Zombie knife. <laughs> Knuckle buckle knife. I see how this works. Check this out. The knives come out on the ends when you squeeze it. <laughs> oh, check this out, guys. Dummy grenades, 10 bucks. That is sweet. Just fire starters. Oh, I see. They're like little sticks. 
you like the sticks. There's a whole bunch in there too. Four for ten bucks. So you get four packs for ten bucks. That is awesome. A dollar for baby wipes. Holy crap, I'm about to stock up on those myself for the tiny. Let's jump on the hog and wait a minute, what is this? Okay, this is cool. Check it out. A party pack, bobbly little pizza things. That is fun. Eight mini pizza crusts and sauce. So you gotta add cheese and whatever else you wanna put on them. That is pretty awesome. I love having like the movie nights and stuff like that. And that would be perfect for that. I think, let's start down this hall well, here. here. All right, here we go. It is so funny you're driving this thing around in here. Oh my God, look at this. The first thing I see, giant hot tubs. Look at this guys, I'm not even kidding. These guys have everything. Wouldn't this be sweet to be kicking in? And look at this one over here. These things are huge. Oh my God. Just imagine all those jets going. Holy crap, that would feel so good. I love this big white. Whoops. But even the small one here is huge. I mean, look at this. It's contoured so you can just kick back in there. I want it. Like, I don't even know where to start. I mean, right beside the hot tubs is a ton of food. Where else are you gonna go that you see that? Oh, yum. I could totally go for some Cap'n Crunch right now. I can tell being on a diet, this is not gonna be a good section for me. But look at this, they've got all the giant boxes. It's not like regular size boxes, it's, it's doubles. Oh, Reese Puffs. <laughs> Moon pies, that immediately makes me think of uh, the Green Mile. Look at this, that would be good for kids' lunches. I haven't had kids in school for so long, but that's how my mind works. 24 of them for 10 bucks. Popcorn for your movie nights. Oh my god, 32 count Twinkies and Ding Dongs. Heck yeah. There is so much stuff here, like for kids' lunches for school. What is this? Look, 69 cents. Whoops. For Caribbean mixed fruit snacks. Six pouches for 69 cents. Oh my god. <laughs> Three, more than three pounds of M&M's. Ah, oh, get me away from these things. Reese peanut butter cups. Holy crap. I just want all this stuff right now. Famous Amos cookies, 42 packs. Cool Pops, a buck 50 for 16. Man, I gotta get out of this food section. Cup of noodles, 30 packs for $10.29. Cheez-Its. All right, I need to stop looking at the food. Holy crap, what is this? <laughs> Maple bacon flavored potato chips. Oh my God. Oh, look at this guys. I saw this, wait a minute. No, that's not what it is. Oh, here it is. <laughs> Larry the Cable Guy macaroni and cheese. A buck twenty-five. I've never tasted it, but I mean, what could it taste like other than macaroni and cheese? But it's Larry the Cable Guy. Get her done. Oh my God! Look at these giant Nutellas. I could go for that right now. All right, I gotta get out of the food and show you guys some of the really cool stuff. I am getting hungry in here. Look at this wax melts. If you guys use any of these in your house, you know this is an awesome price. Two bucks right here. For a whole bunch of these, you get like one fourth of this for two dollars at Walmart. Okay, that one smells like my neighbor. <laughs> Apple cider. Mmm, that smells pretty good. Pumpkin spice. I'm more of like a vanilla person. Here we go. Mm-hmm. That smells good. Look at this, we got shamtastics. What is this? Bed gear down 1.0, dawn 1.0 pillow. Oh my god, that's so soft. And it feels so cool. You know how you like to flip your pillow over at night and have a cool side? Mmm. I like that pillow. 
look at this all this my pillow stuff pillow topper pillows here let's see how yeah it's okay i like the other one better though that other one was so soft i just want to go to sleep on it right now what the heck is a wonder bubble bio bubble wonder bubble guppy preserve oh tarantula heaven heck no it's like a is it a tarantula cage perfect for home decor fish keeping herb gardens dioramas terrarium small animals never seen anything like this and look it comes in different colors purple pink green just giant packs of paper towels 18.99 15 mega rolls. I ought to grab one of those too. I just want to buy everything I see in here. Check these out. I actually saw these posted on the, uh, the Facebook page the other day. Real tree camo floor tiles. Look at that. These are awesome. Six in a pack. And these are, I would guess, about 18 inches. So two side by side would be three feet, and you'd have about three by four and a half feet with one box of these. These are 16 bucks a box, guys. These go for like, I don't know. 40 to 50 bucks each online. There's a couple different kinds, but this is the uh, the Real Realtree Outfitters. And yeah, these go for 50, 60 bucks a box online. $16 a box. Look at this, there's a ton of them. If you want some of these, get down here and get them now. Oh, I could even buy some of these to sell them on eBay. Conflict of interest. Okay, look at this back here. This is one of those spin mops. You put your mop in here and i don't remember if there's a foot pedal or what it is but it spins around to uh to get the water out instead of just wringing it out empty ammo cans pennzoil motor oil 10w40 10w30 1250 for five quarts bunk beds what is this here elite infuser water bottle Oh my god, look at this. A bunk bed with steps. How cool is that? Your kids would be fighting for who's going to sleep on top. <laughs> oh, look at this, guys. Adult coloring books. 99 cents each. These things are pretty expensive. Fashion. What is this? The aviary bird portraits to color. Bird friends. Look at this one. Elephants. Oh my god. It, it's all kinds of different animals. I don't think I'd have the patience to color that kind of stuff though. But that's cool. Look at this. Tons of golf clubs. I don't golf, but I know that four bucks a piece is a good deal. <laughs> Okay, it looks like everything past this point is just like stock back there. So let's go over to the other side here. Continue our exploration. One, two, three. That's what we're gonna go do right now, furniture. This place is stocked, man. Look at all this stuff. Oh my God. I like that little thing right there. I don't know if this is like for outdoors. I think so. Oh, that comes with two, uh, two stools. That's pretty cool. I like that. I don't see a price on it. However, everything in this place is priced 
unbelievably, so I can't imagine it costs very much. Look at all this outdoor furniture here. I'll be back, trusty hog. Look at this, guys. They've got every size of mattress. Look at this huge thing. I've got a king size bed. This would be amazing. Bamboo. I bet that thing is so soft. I really like this. That is pretty awesome right there. I just wanna know how soft this is. I wanna get on it. <laughs> Look at this giant pillow top here. Snuggle. <laughs> Ooh, I like this white set here. Ooh, okay, now here's one I can probably get on and just feel it. Guys, you just sink down into this mattress. It's so soft. That is unbelievable. Okay, this, whoa, 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 whoa. Look at this. This heritage one, this pillow top, I've got to taste, I gotta taste that. <laughs> <sighs> that is so soft. I think the other one is softer. I mean, this pillow top part is really soft, but ugh, the bamboo, like the whole thing, the whole bamboo mattress is so soft over there. It seems like you sink down more in that one. And they've got tons of them. Ooh, somebody, somebody was on that one. Okay, this back here, I believe, is just overstock. If you guys come out here, up there, those flags right there, they put those out at the road. So you can actually see them flying in the wind. Look at this place. It's just enormous, guys. We are just getting started. Look at this couch. That thing is awesome. What do you call that? A chaise lounge on the end there? Oh, that is super comfy. <laughs> it's so strange to have this whole place to myself right now. There is nobody here. And I can just kick back and test all these out. This chair here. Oh my God, that is even softer than the couch. I mean, I love me a good couch, but that's a Serta too. 279. That is soft. As if any furniture is not gonna be soft. Yeah. They're gonna come in here and find me asleep on one of these. <laughs> I love these giant pillows on the arms. This is a beauty rest. It's like everyone I sit in is even softer than the last one. Ah. Oh. There we go. <laughs> you can just kick back watching the game. Not like I watch very many games, but watching the YouTube shows. I just can't help but keep sitting in. This one's a little bit more firm than the other ones, but it's still comfy. You'd have to have like an ottoman to put your feet up. This is the one I was just sitting in. I love that thick stitching too. That looks so cool. Look at this one's like if you wanted to have a movie night. 
you could have your pop in there or your popcorn. Keep your remotes and snacks and stuff in there. Oh, that reclines too. They've got a lot of good brands in here too. Simmons, Ashley, Beautyrest. Here's a lane over here. Look at this theater seating, guys. Just like I was just talking about with the other one. Oh my God, look, it has like a blue lead light. That is awesome. And then, oh, it's like a power recliner, I think. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. That's amazing. Holy crap, look at the light here, guys. All you have to do to turn it off, double tap it, and it comes back on. This may be one of the most awesome couches I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> and then, of course, you've got the single recliner over here. I wonder. Yep. Oh, maybe this one isn't plugged in. Yeah, just the couch. I absolutely love those lead rings on there. <laughs> All right, let me jump back on the hog and head back down this way. There's still tons of furniture up there we haven't even looked at. Okay guys, before we're finished, let's check out some of the uh, outdoor furniture. Wait there for me, backpack. Here's a whole ton of couches that we didn't even look at. Okay, look at this. I like this. I think I think that's bamboo or what the heck do you call that? Like that woven stuff. See how comfy it is. That's pretty comfy. I mean, everything pretty much is. <laughs> I don't know what I expect when I sit down on a soft couch. But, I mean, just imagine kicking back. You got a, a fire pit in front of you. Some friends or a chick right here. And you're just kicking back, watching the fire. Big umbrella here. And then it's time to eat. So you get up and kick back at your table there. Crack open some Coca-Cola or a beer if that's your thing. Look at this, guys. This is a fire pit table. What the heck? Oh, my God. <laughs> that is pretty awesome. I mean, you could literally, like, sit around there and make s'mores around the table. That is cool. Oh, look. I actually have that coffee table and two matching end tables, but... I only use one of the end tables because it's too big for my living room because my couch is probably at least as big as the biggest thing in here. It's huge. All right, let's try out one more chair here. Check the comfiness. Yeah. Put your feet up. That feels pretty good. All right, guys, I think that is pretty much it for the enormous furniture barn. As if that's not enough. Look how big that is. Unbelievable. I just cannot imagine what it's going to be like when all of these barns are full of stuff. Oh 
my god, guys, this place is just stocked. <laughs> One end to the other. Let's just ride all the way down here for a minute and see how how long this barn is. I mean, you remember what I showed you outside? The length of the barns? That's how long these things are, just full of stuff. Look at that. The whole thing is just stocked with stuff. And we got Halloween costumes right here. <laughs> Lord of the Rings, Legolas, bow and arrow set. Where do you even begin in a place like this? I do see an awesome tool chest over here. Remline. Look at this huge thing. It was 1200, now 849. That thing is enormous. Look at all these Halloween costumes and stuff. This is what he said that they kind of like what they want to do in some of the other barns. Just have like the pallets and the boxes where you can just come in and, and look through them and pull stuff out. Look at this. The Fragile box. <laughs> Okay, look at this. There's some, ho uh, not Halloween, but Christmas stuff over here. I see like different lights and things over there. Maybe I'll try to make my way over there. I I'm not sure. I think there's a little aisle over here. We'll go see. But I did notice among the Halloween stuff over here is this inflatable tree. These things are 40 bucks. I don't know how much it is right here. This might be stuff that they really have yet to price yet. I don't know because I don't see any prices. I mean, I'm sure if I took it up there that he would pop up a price for me, of course. But, uh, but I just wonder if there's like more inflatables. Because especially, like I mentioned earlier, I mean, as an eBay seller, I mean, inflatables, holiday inflatables do excellent. Okay, these are projection lights. Valentine's. God, they've got everything in here. What the heck is this? <laughs> what is that? Some kind of decoration. Oh, here's a giant inflatable right here. Nine foot tall uh, archway. It's open, of course, but it could be a return or it could just have been damaged at the store. Who knows? Man. You guys will have to come down here and see this for yourself, but I'm just like beside myself with everything. It's, it's just so packed. I can't believe as I look down this way, look at all that. Unbelievable. More spin mops over here and more uh, golf clubs and stuff. What the? A ginormous bone. <laughs> oh my God. They even have dinosaur bones. <laughs> Look at his baby swings. That's those electronic kinds that are that are uh, run by your cell phone. And again, I don't see any prices on that stuff yet. So this, I must be back in an area where they haven't really 
got this stuff prepared yet. Some of it has prices and some of it doesn't, but man, there's a ton of stuff in here. All right, I gotta start working my way through some more of this stuff. I've been in here for three hours already, guys, <laughs> and I've not even touched this room here. I mean, that is how enormous this place is. This is what's taken me so long. Like every time I start looking at something, I'm like, what the heck is that? I saw this thing back here. I thought it was like drum pads or something. I think it's one of those heaters or something. I don't even know. <laughs> There's so much stuff, guys. Bags, clear bags. Look at this, we got these little couches for kids. Oh my God, there's a whole bunch of them over here. I think they're for kids. Or is that like a pet bed or something? That might be a pet bed. I don't even, oh yeah, pampered pets. It's a pet bed, I thought it was for kids. <laughs> All right, let's just start working my way through. What the heck? Diesel exhaust fluid? What? What is this? Okay, carpets. But what is this? This looks like some kind of a background or something. What the heck? I don't even know. Bamboo pillows. Well, oh, that's just an empty box, which reminds me, he had the other day on, uh, on the Facebook page that they have empty boxes down here, like if you're moving or something. And I could be wrong, but I think they were only 25 cents a box. Might have been 50 cents. But even at 50 cents, I mean, that's a heck of a deal, man. For boxes that size, you're gonna pay about a buck fifty a piece at Walmart. Look at this pet stuff. There's a whole box of giant bones. The dinosaur bones. <laughs> oh my god. Pet food, what the heck is this thing? Wally whale. Something fishing tackle? What in the heck? Delta tackle. I don't know what that is except for get away! Oh my God, I was just thinking they got everything in here except the kitchen sink. And I looked down and there's a toilet. <laughs> Guys, there's just so much stuff. My head is just spinning. What is this? Porta cool advantages. Three speed vertical tank. I'm not even sure what that is, but they have it. A bike carrier for the back of a car. Oh, look at this. People were loving this on the, on the Facebook group. This is a portable grill. It folds up, football not included. <laughs> Here's another one of those porta cool things. It must be some kind of an air conditioner or something. I don't know. Headlamps. Look at this telescoping camping fork. I wonder what a grizzly grip is. Wheelbarrow, wheelbarrow tool grips. I don't even know what that is, but they're six bucks and they got them. <laughs> I'm telling you, there's just, there's so much stuff in here. I just, I don't know, my head is just spinning, it's crazy. I've never driven a Harley around a store before. Look at this, Q-tips. What is this? Transparent Roswell Alien Kit. It's a model of an alien. <laughs> Look at this, they got all kinds of toys. A Dory storybook pillow. What the heck is that? A flying ball. The golden snitch. Pool floats. Lead mirror, 16 lead lights. Hmm. Oh look guys, a football toy box. Now that's only about the half the size of the uh, the old Little Tykes ones, but that's pretty cool anyway. It's so overwhelming looking at all this stuff. I mean, look back down the aisle there. <laughs> you could just stand in one place for about 25 minutes and still not see everything. Draco high chairs, if you got a kid. All right, let's go around through the other aisle here one more time quick. Like down there, it looks like it's mostly like household stuff, toiletries and, and body wash and stuff like that. I could be wrong, because there's everything you can imagine in here, but 
Wait a moment. Look at this. Home is where you park it. I love that. Oh my God. I have got to get an RV, guys. That is so cool. Emergency ration meals. Pop-Tarts, crackers. White chicken and Alfredo sauce. With... That's pretty cool. I'm amazed this little motorcycle thing fits through everywhere in this store. All right, let's make one more. Oh my God, we've never even been down this aisle. I didn't even know it existed. It was incognito. <laughs> this is all like bedding, sheets and stuff. Here's more pillows, bamboo pillows. It's just impossible for me to even show you guys everything in here. You just have to come down here and see it for yourself. I mean, this is this is bigger than any flea market I've ever even been to. Throw myself off the Harley here. <laughs> what the heck is this? Ski boots. I don't even remember. Job Rogue. Hmm. Look at this. A paintball case to hold your paintball gun and stuff. Mountain Dew helmet. Michael Jackson bobbleheads. <laughs> Indoor ceiling lighting. More lighting. Unbelievable, guys. There's there's even a lot of stuff that I've seen on the Facebook page that I have not found in here. I mean, it is that packed with stuff. I'm gonna have to wrap it up, though. I've been filming for like three hours in here. Whoa, I like this one better. This one, home is where you park it, and it's an RV. I love that. All right, guys, well, we are gonna call it a day on this exploration. It has been totally awesome. And like I said, you're just gonna have to come down here for yourself and see everything in here because I haven't even seen it all and I've been here for three hours. So thank you for watching. Make sure you check out The Bargain Barn on Facebook. I'll have a link below. Um, have the address on here and the phone number if you guys wanna give a call or, uh, you know, come on down here and check it out for yourself.